Hi, boys and girls. Welcome to your skill builder task for today. I'd like to start out the last couple of weeks we've been working on comparing numbers and seeing if they balance, if they're equal, if there's any difference, if it's true, if it's not true. Well, today I'd like to use two equations to see if they are equal. It's not to find a sum or an answer, it's to see if the two sides balance. And if they don't balance, then they're not the same. So we have the equations six plus seven is equal to seven plus four. Now we know, and I know you know, I can hear you telling me, Miss McCourt, we've done this a ton of times. Well, that's true. So, but we have to remember as a review that we have to prove it. Okay, so we have to prove, we can't just say, oh, six plus seven equals is the same as seven plus four. Yes, that's true. Well, because Ms. McCourt and Ms. Wertha and Ms. M and Ms. Seegers and Ms. Thomas are all gonna say, gotta prove it to me. So I've drawn some number lines so that I can figure out my equations and figure out the answers quickly. Because at this stage in the game, you're almost second graders and you know how to do this. So. If I had six and seven more, I would start at six. I don't have to start my number line at one. I'd start at six. And then I know that to get to the number friendly number 10, I just need to jump four. So I already know that six and four are 10. So I know that four and three more is seven. So then I have to do three more jumps. So one, two, three. So I know that seven plus six is 13. So I'll write that on top of here, just so I remember. Okay. Now I have to figure out, hmm, seven and four more. So again, I've drawn a number line. I've drawn to a past where I know the number will go. And I've started with the number seven. So I have seven and I know that seven and three more equals 10. Okay, so I have my three right here because I know seven and three is 10, quick. All right, so I know that three and one more is four. So I know that seven and four is 11. So I'm gonna put that number up here. Now I'm gonna read my equation again, except I'm gonna figure out six plus seven is the same as 13 and seven and four more is equal to 11. Those two numbers are not the same. So my equation is not true. Okay, on the next slide, you're gonna answer some equations, whether it's true or not. Okay, so you have to say whether they are true. You are going to have some help. I've embedded or I've put some anchor charts on there to help you, whether it's a 100 chart or if it's a double 20 frame. You're going to have a number line, okay, with two number lines. You can open them up by clicking on them and they will help you so they can help answer your questions. And then after that, we're going to put this into a word problem, okay? So have fun on the next slide. Remember what we've learned and show us what you've learned, okay? I'll see you in a minute.